Good morning, KGE. Today, we are going to learn about a new letter and the letter is P. Look at the blue arrow. It is pointing towards capital cursive P. This is lowercase p in cursive. The green arrow is pointing towards p in print and the sound that letter p makes is p. 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 Today, we will learn the phonic sound of letter P, that is P. You will also learn the associated vocabulary of letter P through a story. You will consolidate the vocabulary through an activity. Now, let's listen to the story of a beautiful and kind girl. Her name is Paula. This is Paula. Paula. She lives with her mother in a small hut. They were very poor. Poor ka matlab hota hai garib. Wo bohot garib the. Paula was a kind girl and she would always help others who were in need. Near her hut was a small pond, Peepa Pond. Around that pond grew beautiful pink roses, Peepa Pink Roses. Every day she would collect these pink roses and take them to the village. Paula, Peepa Paula would sell the roses and with that money she would buy food. One day, no one bought her pink roses, so she had no money to buy the food. She was very sad. Paula sat under a tree and started crying. She prayed. People prayed to God to help her. Three fairies lived on that tree and heard her crying and praying. The fairies decided to help Paula. The three fairies turned themselves into different birds. A parrot, people parrot. A pigeon, people pigeon. And a beautiful peeper peacock. Paula was surprised to see these birds who could talk. The parrot, peeper parrot, asked Paula to feed them. 
as they were hungry. Ola had one piece of old bread. She broke the bread into pieces and gave them to the birds. After eating, the birds flew away. Soon, the fairies appeared and they gave her a magical pot, paper pot, told her that the pot has magic and now she will never stay hungry. Paula took the pot. Peeper Paula took the pot, Peeper Pot, home and used the magic words Cook Pot Cook. Paula and her mother had delicious porridge, Peeper Porridge, which made them happy. Now they would never sleep hungry. Paula would go to the village every day and sell her pink roses along with the delicious porridge to the villagers and earn lots of money. Now they were not poor anymore. After some days, Paula went back to the fairies with a picnic basket, Peepa picnic basket. She made some delicious sandwiches, juices and popcorns, Peepa popcorns for the fairies. She thanked them and they all enjoyed the picnic. I hope you like the story children. Let's recall our words from our story starting with letter P. -p a prayer. We pray to God every day. A people. A pond. A pink roses. A pigeon. Paula, the kind and sweet girl, a pot, and a porridge, a popcorn, a picnic. Very good, my children. Activity time children. This activity is all about becoming a prince, a princess or a pirate. You can choose any of the characters. Now what you have to do? You will dress up like a prince. All the boys can dress up like a prince or a pirate. And the girls can dress up like princess or a pirate. Then you will make your own treasure box or a bag. Collect objects starting with letter P, P and place them 
in a box or a bag. For example, if you have a pink crayon, pink clips, pink pencil, or a pink dress, even pink rubber band or a pink shirt. So you collect them and put it in a bag or a box. When you take out each item, you will say, for example, if I become a pirate, I will say, I am Pirate Amar and this is my blue parrot, P -p parrot. I hope you will enjoy doing this activity, my children. And do not forget to send your photographs or videos to Amar Ma'am. Enjoy!